England, of course, taking to the field for the first time in this edition of the most prestigious festival in world football. No doubt looking for a performance to set a tone. There's his great vocal support. There are many, many who have travelled to watch them and every one of those supporters willing them to give everything back for the cause. It is beautifully set here. Wonderful scenes here in the Dutch capital inside this terrific arena. One that does more than justice to the stature of the man whose name it bears. And we rise now for the English national anthem. The imperative for everyone, three points on opening day. Well, Peter, both of these teams will take to the pitch with a three-point focus. Ambition is fresh and strong, and each will want to go deep into the competition, so neither will be looking to come out of this with a, a flawed game plan. This has to be assured and close to their best. we go then Jim who do you reckon is pivotal yeah Raheem Sterling he could be the key man for me Peter because he's so quick and direct with the has a hit and it's hoisted clear and here's Kane real chance it's in and what a great way to start the game to spark the game, I mean, the captain has basically triggered a contest that should be even livelier than we anticipated. Get your seatbelts on, this could be rather exciting. Oh, what a cracking goal, but a cracking touch as well. That's what made it for me. That's brilliant play all around. England take the early advantage. Sancho. He's through. Oh, the ball's come loose and the chase is on. And here's Sterling. Came with a shot. Goal! 2-0 and in next to no time. Quality goal, lovely first touch, sumptuous second. England get themselves a two-goal cushion. Well, it's been a, an absolutely fabulous spell for them, and they're starting to look unstoppable. There could be more on the way. Good challenge, he just stood firm. And here's Kane. Oh, what a ball, and the finish! Double quick time! Yeah, looking back at that, that's how you play on the counter. Quick and decisive and ruthless with the finish. I thought it was a stunning, stunning breakaway.
England take a three-goal lead and they are romping out of sight. No doubt as to who has the momentum here now. The only doubt is how many is coming. Chilwell. Now it's Sterling. And here's Kane. Shapes to shoot! A real chance and a real let-off. Yeah, on another occasion, all that went wrong may come right. And it's Kane. Sancho needed to come up with a better ball. Uh, was too timid to make it. And the shot! Well, Red, he sorted that out. And it's played forward. Gomez cuts it out. Henderson tries to get it forward quickly. Right through the middle. Oh, is it? Has a pop! Looking back on that, it was some save and potentially a big moment for the keeper and his team. Sterling. Well positioned to make that interception. Who's ball? Who's going to get that? Kate. He's gone for it. <laughs> Players ecstatic. Fans delirious. This is utopian. Simple finish at the end. What do you think, Jim? It's almost criminal to see a defence fail to identify someone who thrives when it comes to shooting stats. They knew, and yet they didn't need them. They paid the price and deserved it. He snuffles his turn, and that earned him the match ball. This is one of the best performances I've seen in a while. He's practically taken on this team single handedly, and they don't know how to stop him. Things looking so easy, almost too easy here. Hoists it forward. Finds himself eased off the ball. And no, that is pretty much the end of that. Well, that's surely a foul free kick. Jordan Henderson. Now it's Kane. Forward it goes. Gets away from his opponent. Now it's Sterling. He's made sure that that won't get through. The whistle goes for half time. Well, that flew by. It was breathless stuff. It's been one way traffic here after the first 45 minutes. A relentless barrage that looks set to continue. Yeah, I think the first half performance that showed attack being the best form of defence. If they're in the face of the opposition that much, then there's little they can do in return. And I'm, I'm not sure how long they can keep the intensity and the tempo up, but it's certainly paid off so far. England have run riot in the first half and barring a miraculous comeback they have done the job already so we're just settling back into this second half
Goes direct to the front line. Sancho, whose goal scoring skills have already been evident. Henderson drives it forward. Kane. It's out for a goal kick. England clearly seem to have lost their passing accuracy, something they're obviously going to have to fix pretty quickly now. Kane has a hit! And that's past the post. Well, he did get himself into a good position, something for him to cling to. Sancho, Kane, it's a brilliant interception, and he's there to hoof it away. They're actually not getting too tight, which is interesting. Oh, it's probably cautionary, uh, don't dive in, try to pinch it or, or intercept so nobody can get in behind. Pinged forward. And it's Kane. Sterling, who does have an assist to his name. And that's sprayed out wide. And he's there to clear it. Kane. Got offside that time. Some activity down on the touchline. It seems there's going to be a change. It's going to be a double change then. Keeper's got good distance on that. Now it's Sterling. Played in with accuracy. Oh, well intercepted, really alert to the danger. Well, he acknowledges that he should have come up with something better. It's one! I really don't think you could expect anything better from the goalkeeper then. We're near heroic territory. And more than happy to take the muscular approach. Kane. England get it back again. Kane really was well marshalled there because he was denied the opportunity to, to turn. And now they can launch a counter. Tries to get it forward quickly. The message is clear, none shall pass. Now it's Sterling. And it's Chilwell. He's come loose. And that's that. England have got off to an ideal start. Three points on day one. And it goes well for the campaign ahead. How would you sum up what we've witnessed, Jim? Listen, ideally, any new campaign needs a start that puts three points on the board. And it's mission accomplished. Nothing too fancy was required, just a, a good solid team.